So eSentNod32 Antivirus is a service designed to keep your personal data and devices safe from online threats, like malware, ransomware, phishing attacks, and spyware, which is very important, especially in this day and age, where a big part of our lives is spent online, whether it's for shopping, banking, streaming, or just browsing. Now, ESET has been a trusted name in cybersecurity for decades, and it's known for offering reliable, lightweight protection for Windows, Mac, and Android devices. So in today's video, I'll be walking you through everything that you need to know about ESET, including its features, pricing, some pros and cons, and whether it's worth considering for your online security needs. With that said, let's get right into it. So first, I want to talk about what ESET Nod32 Antivirus is. ESET was founded in 1992 and is designed to protect your devices and personal data from online threats that can compromise your security by stealing data, locking files, or tricking you into giving them sensitive information. And it offers real-time protection to block suspicious activity and antivirus scans to detect and remove harmful files before they become an issue. It also includes tools like a firewall and anti-phishing features, which I'll get into later on in this video. Now let's talk about how ESETNOD32 Antivirus actually works to protect your devices and data from online threats. Well, the first step is signing up and choosing one of ESETNOD32's plans. And if you're interested, I've left a discounted affiliate link in the description down below, so you can get a better deal than going directly to their website. Then, once you've signed up, you'll need to download the app to your devices, whether it's your computer, phone, or tablet, which is available on Windows, Android, and Mac OS, making it accessible for most users. But ESET doesn't currently offer an iOS app, which might be a drawback if you use Apple devices like iPhones or iPads. Anyway, once it's downloaded, the app will guide you through the setup process step-by-step, step, which is straightforward and easy to follow. Now, once you've set up your ESET account and installed the app, one of the first things you'll probably want to do is run an antivirus scan. There are three options, a quick scan for commonly targeted threats, a full system scan for everything, including hidden files, and a custom scan for specific folders or devices like USB drives, or if you have important files that need extra monitoring. And so to really test ESET, I uploaded some infected files to my computer and phone, and ran both a smart scan and a custom scan on both devices. And they caught everything I tested, including viruses, spyware, and ransomware. What really stood out to me though, was that my devices didn't slow down at all during the scans. I could keep working, streaming, or whatever I was doing without noticing a difference, which was a problem that I found on some cheaper or free antiviruses in the past. That's a huge plus, because nothing's more frustrating than your device freezing during a scan, and I know I have no patience for that. After that, you'll want to turn on the real-time protection feature, which works quietly in the background to protect your devices 24-7. This means it's constantly scanning for threats like malware, which is harmful software that can damage your device or steal your data, and phishing attempts, which are fake emails or links designed to trick you into giving away your personal information and spyware, which is a type of malicious software that secretly monitors your activities and collects sensitive information without your consent. To see how well it really worked, I tested it by clicking on a suspicious link that mimicked a login page for an online shopping account, something I wouldn't normally do, but wanted to see how ESET would handle it. Within seconds, ESET flagged it as a phishing attempt and blocked it right away before any harm could be done. Phishing links like this are designed to trick you into giving them your personal information, like your username and password. So it's a big deal that ESET caught it right away. Now ESET doesn't just cover the basics, it includes some advanced tools that really stand out. One of these is the ransomware shield, which basically keeps an eye on your files for unusual activity and blocks ransomware attacks before they can lock you out of your data. If you're not familiar, Ransomware is a type of malware that takes control of your files like photos or important documents and demands a payment to unlock them. And so this feature is very helpful for keeping your personal information safe and secure. Another feature I found surprisingly useful is the device control, which stops unauthorized USB drives from accessing or copying your data. So if you work in a shared space or frequently use external devices, 
This can help reduce the risk of malware spreading or sensitive information being stolen. And for online transactions, ESET offers a safe banking mode, which essentially adds an extra layer of security. It opens a secure browser that protects details like your passwords and credit card information from being tracked or stolen. I tried it for a few transactions, and it made me feel a lot better knowing my personal information was secure. On top of that, ESET takes your privacy seriously with features like the webcam protection that alerts you if any app tries to access your webcam without your permission, which is a huge relief, as no one wants to deal with that kind of invasion. And besides your device's privacy, ESET also helps secure your online activities, especially when using public Wi-Fi, because ESET's firewall and network inspector help keep your connection secure. The network inspector even shows you all the devices connected to your network, which is very useful for helping you find anything suspicious, like finding unknown connections, potential security risks, or devices using too much bandwidth. And if you're using multiple devices, ESET makes managing them easy with its ESET Home platform, where you can monitor all of your devices, add new ones to your account, and even share protection with family members. It's user-friendly and doesn't require any technical knowledge. And finally, if you ever run into any issues or have any questions, ESET's support team has got you covered. They're available through live chat, email, or phone, so getting help is quick and convenient. Plus, their help center is full of step-by-step -step guides and FAQs that make it easy to figure out common problems. All right, so that's all well and good, but how much does it all cost? ESET offers several options to match different needs and budgets. The Nod32 antivirus plan is $40 per year and covers one device making it a great choice for basic protection. For more coverage, the Essential plan costs $60 per year, protecting up to three devices with added features like real-time protection, safe browsing, and device control. The Premium plan costs about $70 per year and includes everything in the Essential plan, plus extras like a secure password manager and data encryption for added peace of mind. Now, if you have multiple devices, the Ultimate plan is a great choice. It costs around $180 per year and covers up to five devices and includes advanced features like an unlimited VPN and metadata cleanup. For businesses, the Small Business Security Plan starts at $180 per year for five devices and it offers features like ransomware protection, password health checks, and secure sharing. And if you run larger businesses, you can opt for premium plans starting at $211 per year for comprehensive network protection. And again, if at this point you're really considering trying ESET Nod32's antivirus, I'll leave a discounted affiliate link in the description below that'll get you a discount that you wouldn't be able to get by going directly through their website. Now, while ESET Nod32 is very useful, like just about every product or service, or really just about anything, it's not perfect. For example, while the software runs smoothly and has a ton of great features, the fact that there's no iOS app could be a downside for those of you who mainly use Apple devices like an iPhone or iPad. So it would be nice to have that option since many people use Apple devices these days. Also, the dashboard is pretty simple to use, but the more advanced features like controlling devices or encrypting data might take a while to get the hang of, especially if you're not used to them. In my opinion, it's not a big deal but there's definitely a bit of a learning curve, but once you get the hang of it, it's pretty simple. So now the big question is, would I recommend ESET Nod32 antivirus? Absolutely. ESET is a great option for anyone who values speed and reliability without the unnecessary extras. It focuses on the essentials, keeping your devices safe from malware, ransomware, and other digital threats all while running smoothly in the background. And so if you're looking for a straightforward, effective antivirus protection, ESET Nod32 is definitely worth considering. And just to remind you one more time, if you're thinking about giving ESET Nod32 a try, I'll leave a discounted affiliate link down in the description below for an extra discount that you won't find directly on their website. Anyway, that's it for today's video. I hope you found this review helpful. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe for more reviews like this one. And if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to let me know down in the comments below, and I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible. Other than that, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.